Hey runners, time to get warmed up for the 8th Annual Ted Tasco Education Foundation's Trot with Ted. My name is Julie Garish and I'm with Julie Garish Fitness in Sturbridge. We offer in-person and online personal training and group fitness classes. And we follow all state and local guidelines for safety and cleaning for all our in-person training and classes. Let's get to it. We're going to start with the ankles. For one foot forward, we're going to start with our right foot. Drive your knee over your toes, pressing your heel into the floor, and then sit back with the toes. We're going to do five of these on each side. Make sure you get your knee as far over your toes as you can without lifting your heel. Okay? We got one more of these, and then we're going to switch to the other side. Same thing. Drive that knee forward, and then sit back with the toes. Five on this side. You are going to be good to go after this warm up, ready for your run. One more. All right, continue with our ankle warm up. We're going to do some little ankle hops. So we're just hopping up and down, little hops, not a big squat jump, just warm it up, have fun with it. Maybe put on some music. Groove to the beat. A few more. Let's keep going a little bit longer. Okay. We're going to keep going with the ankles by going up on our toes and back down. So, you want to push through your big toes. If you're losing your balance, like I just did, you can hold on to something like a wall. Make sure you don't go to the outside of your feet, but rather push all the way through all the toes. We're going to do three more. Warming up those calves and ankles. And now we're going to do a cat-cow standing. So arms go behind the head. Pull your elbows down. Squeeze your shoulder blades together. Look up. That's our cow part. And then we're going to thread our fingers together. Round the back. Tuck the chin for the cat part. Let's do two more of each. So pull those elbows down, looking up, lace the fingers, round, tuck the chin. One more time. Good. Really get a good squeeze, open up the chest, and we're gonna lace those fingers together and tuck it under. All right, let's give our knees a hug, shall we? Grab your leg just below, pull up toward the chest. Again, if you're losing your balance, you can hold on to the wall and just do one leg repeating about five times and then switch. We're gonna go four more each. Staying as tall as you can. Two, last one. Let's squat. Feet are about hip width apart. Pull your abs in, sit back into your heels. We're gonna push a little to the outside of the heels as we squat down. You want to make sure that your heels stay down, come up nice and tall. We're going to do three more squats, and then we're going to add on two and one. Now we're going to reach down into our squat, and then come up onto our toes, reach overhead. So again, pushing through those big toes, big reaches. We've got three more two, last one. All right, take a step forward, curl your hips under, reach that arm across and over. We're then going to take our back leg, pull it up, reach the opposite arm up. Squeeze that glute on your stretching side. Let's do the same thing on the other side. Other leg comes back, we curl the hips under, reach that arm up and over. And then we grab our back foot. If you can, those are your balance. Pull up to the glute and then reach that arm up. Good, we're gonna do one more on each side. So left leg back, curl the hips under, reach that arm over, big stretch, grab your back leg, reach the opposite arm up, stay tall. One more time, curl the hips under, 
reach that arm up and over, and then we'll grab our back foot, reach that other arm up towards the ceiling. All right, time for some hip hinges. We're gonna go a little wider with the feet, bend the knees, reach the arms forward, and drive your hips back. Little bend in those knees, come up nice and tall. Let's do it again. Your head should be looking down towards the floor. Your back should be nice and flat. Good, let's do one more of these. We're almost ready. All right, we're gonna drop, we're gonna do our hip hinge and we're gonna drop our arms down towards the floor. And then we're gonna turn and reach one arm up toward the ceiling and then the other arm up. We're leaning a little bit into each hip. We're opening up our chest, our back, and our shoulders. Let's do one more each. Last one. And now we're onto our final warm up stretch. We're gonna go a little wider stance. Start lunging into one side and reaching across with the opposite hand. So we're turning a bit at the waist. Good, driving your hips back still. Now we're gonna to try to go a little lower towards the foot. Good, we're gonna do three more. Two, last one. All right, you are ready to run. Have a great turkey trot.